Hi, John. You're in the zone. Yeah. Um, what Leah was saying about how she didn't think even if we went to a playoff system, it would be better. I mean, she said it wouldn't be perfect, but I think it would still be better because you'd actually determine who a champion is on a field that went through a bracket, you know. And, you know, at the end of basketball season every year, you don't see the team that got left out on Selection Sunday peti- petitioning Congress to try to determine that they got ripped off. I mean, Creighton fan, they kind of try to, I guess, because they think they should have won the title. But besides them, usually – we respect, you know, that North Carolina is the champion, and we don't debate that in mid-July. So I just think that would still be better. So I don't agree with her on that point. Right, John, pre- all. Right, appreciate the call. Good to hear yeah, from you at nine five one sixteen twenty. That's one of the many arguments that are. Hi, right, I just wanted to uh, make, to comment on and ask how it was that Creighton uh, ends up getting bashed in a BCS discussion. Like Hus- Husker fan will find uh, find a way. I, I believe he was I trying to relate it, it to the truth. <laughs> Thank you, Scott. I believe every time you do it, it's necessary. <laughs> I, it's kind of like every time you walk past a girl with a really nice butt and you look, it's the same thing. I, bu- I believe because of the notion of the uh, tournament and Creighton being one of the last People teams complaining for a while. Yeah. As Nick Boss said just last week, hey, we didn't deserve to be in. <laughs>